Hi guys and welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be doing some League vs. League. We are playing this league ranked inside, well not inside, around the 3,000 rank. My league, H-Town Greats, is around 4,500. It's a league that I play in with my friend in real life and let's just see what kind of score we can get today. I usually try to get the highest defense and... There's an 82 and an 81, so I'll take the 82. He has not been played against. It's D Moore. I should be able to get a good score since I have an overall advantage, but you never know. So, we have a 400 power advantage. I'm going to start it off with the kick return here. I have the uh, 83 Josh Cribs from the Path to Greatness set. And let's just go ahead and return this one. Let's see what kind of blocks we get and we get that to around the 30 uh, an extra five yards of field position so we're going to start it off with middle slant i pretty much always hit the drag route to metcalf here or i might could scramble if the drag route's covered pretty well and it's an all-out blitz we get to him he's got what he's wide open got a lot of room we get a block from jj watt and that might be all we need it is going to be all we need for the touchdown, just a one-play TD, easy as that. And for the two-point conversion, I've gotten to where I pretty much use double drags every time in a set like this. Depending on how the defense uh, plays it, I will scramble to either the left or the right and throw it if I have to or run it in with Minshew. So I'm going to go back. The right side of the field is open, so I scramble this way. <laughs> no opening to throw, but it doesn't matter. I run it in anyway. Easy eight points on the first drive. So let's go ahead and enter drive number two. All right. Let's see if we can get a big return here. I'm going to try to set up some good blocks. It is in the end zone deep. Not deep in the end zone, but it is in the end zone. So we're going to have to really try hard. And nothing there. Good kick coverage and not very good blocking. So first and ten, we're not going to... We're not going to change the script. Let's go up. We'll uh, go with middle slant. If it's an all-out blitz like it was last time, we've got a good opportunity to get a big play, and it is. I'll hold it, and I throw. Metcalf's wide open. Do I get a block? We get another block from Watt. Can we outrun the defense? And we're not going to be able to do it. Number 20 chases me down just in time, but another huge play on first down with middle slant. Trying to find out who that number 20 is. Maybe Landon Collins there. I think that's who that is. I don't, I can't tell what number Slay is, but I do think that was Landon Collins that chased me down. If that's 20. Anyway, so we're going to go with Halfback Blast here. It, this one looks again like another all out blitz. Let's see what we get. And it is, do I get, I can't get enough blocking. My left tackle ran to empty space for some reason. But anyway, second down. And 12, the pass is going to be working great against this blitz, so I'm going to go with posts. And the way I like to go with posts is scramble out to the right and hit the tight end on that corner route or hit the flat route to Marquise Brown or just run it myself with the QB. So it's another blitz. We get around him, and we've got some room. They run away from us, and we get the first down. So first and 10. So first down and 10. Let's see what we got here. Motion halfback plunge. Going to be running this one to the left. Got some room, but I didn't get any effort out of my left tackle there to block. May not have been his fault, but it was a corner blitz it looked like. Didn't get any blocks. So second and 11, let's go with tight end out. And all of a sudden he shows prevent here. First time he has not shown blitz. So I'm going to scramble out this way. Going to hit Watt. And instead of cutting up field like I told him to, he decides to fall out of bounds. Anyway, though, third and six, we'll get it, but my players are not helping me out at all. Third and six, tight end angle. Going to hit J.J. Watt on the angle route. Uh, I can't... Oh, and EA decides to make him stumble. I don't know what EA decided to do there. 
I was trying to scramble because of the blitz. Then, uh, then got a blitz off the right side. Let's watch this again. Here he comes. No one attempts. Well, they. I don't know what. Let's see. My left, my left guard here. He's free. Doesn't have anyone on him, but he never sees the linebacker coming to blitz me. And so I try to scramble and run back. Then EA makes him stumble just so I can be sacked. Thanks, EA, for making an awful animation to kill any chance I had of getting away from him. Man, that is annoying. So fourth and 20, we've got a big hole for us. I'm going to go with Seattle. EA did not give us any help there by making a stumble. I don't know why they do that. But anyway, we're going to try to overcome it. Um, I'm going to try to scramble out to the right and hit Metcalf if I can draw the one of the defenders off of him. Let's see what we can do. going to scramble out to the right here. No attempt to block, but we throw it, and it's caught by Metcalf for the touchdown. That is a good play, and we're going to look at that again. Again, it was another blitz. We didn't great, get great blocking either, but we scrambled out, and come on now, and had just enough room. So uh, what I did, I dropped back about three steps, and then I scrambled. I threw it just before he got there because, I mean, Bell went inside, and once I got outside, they were able to get to me, but Bell didn't give me any help. But thankfully, it was one-on-one -on -one coverage with Slay and Metcalf, and Metcalf was in front of him where he could get the easy catch. Slay almost got in there, but it was a touchdown, and so we do what we have to do. We overcome some rough animations and some good defensive play to get in the end zone. So that's 14 so far. Double drags again. Gonna scramble out to the right. I'm just going to run this one in. If you've got an open path to run it in, go ahead and do it. Because it's easier. You can trust running it if you've got a clear path more than you can a pass. Because a lot of times... A lot of times passes can be more risky if it's not wide wide open especially on a two-point conversion when you have just one play to do it uh so if if you can run it in with the quarterback go ahead and do it it's much safer that way so we're going to go to the second drive we have 16 points so far and we're going to return this one we can get a block oh we don't get one but we break it anyway if only that one i think it was 26 right there bell he ran over to the left instead of blocking him or i had a pretty decent return there the blocking on this game is weird and i'm not going to be running it this defense seems to be geared to stop the run more so we're at the 22 i'm going to try with middle slant it looks like another all-out blitz so i'm going to try to hold it as long as i can then hit metcalf I gotta throw it quickly, and he's wide open. JJ Watts out in front blocking. He doesn't get a great block though, so we are not going to be able to take it all the way to the end zone. Number forty-one makes the tackle. So let's go with double drags. Let's see who number forty-one is. That's Antoine Bethay. Made the game-saving tackle, not the game-saving, the touchdown-saving tackle. And again, another all-out blitz looks like. We're gonna try to hit Watt quickly. What happened? I was going backwards, and all of a sudden he falls down. Let's look at the instant replay and see what happens. What did happen? Just all of a sudden took off running straight into Le'Veon Bell. It got knocked down. I, that is a strange animation, but... Second down, 13. We're going to go with posts. Again, it is on the right hash, but we can still manage this one. He may be blitzing this time. He doesn't seem to be showing as much blitz. He's not. He backs. I'm going to throw that away. Just perfect defense there. Absolutely perfect. Didn't have any room to run. So we're going to go with Seattle here. Going to try to run it the same way we ran it last time. We've got some blocks somewhat this time. We fire, and Metcalf kept. Did EA really just say he was out of bounds? I'm going to have to bring out instant replay again because I think I got ripped off. Let's watch this. He makes the catch. Caught it. One foot. 
Well, that may be a good call. I don't know how he didn't get two feet in, but he really didn't. Not sure that he did there. So we're going to go Seattle one more time. I may have to hit the tight end this time. And we hit the tight end, Watt, who makes the catch, takes it past the 25. So Seattle bailing us out today. Definitely not getting good performances out of my players and defense and the animations have been crazy today. But we're, we managed to pick up another fourth down conversion. First and 10, we're going to run the football this time. The opponent, 22. Halfback blast. It's a big blitz. Oh, man. And DK Metcalf runs away from his block at just the wrong time. If he had kept blocking, we had some space there. But for some reason on this game, the blockers run away from their blocks when you get close to them. I, I'm not really sure why. <clears throat> wow, the animations in this match have not been good. Hopefully that will settle down anyway middle slant again let's see we've got don't have a blitz this time but we've got wide open Metcalf on the drag route on the right side and we take that inside the 10 for the first first down and goal so let's go with fullback blast this is a coach Frank Reich play let's see if we can catch him by surprise and we do we take it all the way to the one Alvin Kamara punches it in all the way there. So we're going to go with fullback dive. Let Kamara try to do it again. And he cannot quite fall in there. Lost his balance. So third down goal. We're going to go with halfback steam flipped. Hold the joystick at the 11 o'clock position. And run it in there. Well, it took a little effort. But we got there. Bell with the two point conversion. And we're going to go with double drags to try to make it a 20. Oh boy. I have not seen this formation from him yet. And Minshew did not throw the football. I ran straight backwards through the ball, but Minshew never even tried to do it. So we get 22. Irritating three drives there. Well, irritating last two drives. Terrible animations and stuff. But we overcome it and get 22 points on the board. Uh, hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And uh, if you guys are subscribers, be sharing my videos. Uh, get more people to see them and maybe subscribe. Uh, if you have subscribed, hit the bell button beside the subscribe button so that you will get notifications when I upload a video or start streaming. Thank you guys for your support. God bless you all, and I'll see you guys again later.